lesbian grooming. <laughs> you don't talk. This I'm very excited to talk about our uh, topic this topic week. this week. Television. Tell. Oh, say it again. Television. Be more specific. Television shows. No, be specific. About television the shows on television. Television shows on television with lesbian characters. Boom! Didn't see that coming. No. Let's have a heart to heart here, okay? We all do this. We are guilty of this as well. We will watch any show as long as they have lesbians in it. Like six seasons what? of some shitty ass show. That is so much of our life. Wasted. Okay, let's start with Grey's Anatomy. First couple seasons of Grey's Anatomy was great. I really liked it. No lesbians, still watched it, loved it. But then they threw in the lesbian character, Calzone. Callie. Callie, no, Cal. You didn't even watch it. Callie was with someone else <laughs> first, okay? okay? Now I've watched nine seasons of Grey's Anatomy just because of Callie in Arizona. They fucking look at each other and we fucking make gifts of that shit. It's sad, it's ladies. So sad. Why do we do that to ourselves? Yeah. I'll, I'll just go on YouTube and I'll just watch clips of them together in my bed at nighttime. Don't say that. Why not? Okay, put your leg down. <sighs> okay, but we. You'll know that you don't like the show. Because you bad. don't like any of the characters it's or the story. Really bad. But you watch it to see like your favorite lesbians in one scene, like a 30 second scene. I'll and it's like, we'll watch it just maybe, just maybe to see them kiss. I feel like most of you are just watching this for the chance that maybe we will kiss. The creator, they know that. The creators know that. I say that. Yeah. And then sometimes if there's a show that doesn't have lesbian characters, we just make them up. Like Rizzoli and Isles. Okay, we're gonna talk about something um, that- Close to our hearts. Close to our heart. In Canada. This is a Canadian show. Shot in Toronto, Lost Girl. I think the only reason that show is still on the air because is because we lesbians watch it. Guys, really, when you think about it, it's it's pretty bad. It's a really bad show. It doesn't even make sense. It makes no sense. They just they just make shit up as they go along. What? Spoiler alert. Why the fuck did Tamsin spend like six episodes collecting people's hair and shit just for the finale to throw it on the ground and be like it's a dud. It doesn't make sense. The show doesn't make any sense. And this is a great forum for me because I have wanted to discuss this. I know we love it, but what the hell are with those sex scenes? They are dripping sweat. And they're just like kissing each other. They're just like fucking like- Nothing's happening. Like, oh my god, I'm so tired. I need more energy. Your only viewers are tuning in for these moments right now. I want to see why you're so tired. They can't get away with this shit. Zoe Palmer, if you're watching this right now, we gave up on Glee. There's only so much we can take. After Britannia broke up, I'm just like, what's the point now? Not even. I gave up before that. No, don't. Well, then you're not a real lesbian. No. But if I hear that Britannia will get back together, I'm going to watch it. Because I have no self-respect. Thank you for still watching Pillow Talks. We really appreciate it. Please subscribe. Please like the video. We have tons of fun stuff coming out, actually, for the summer. So... Do we? We were also thinking about uh, maybe having some guests on the show to rant with us. So maybe leave a comment what? on who you'd like to see w in bed with us. Okay. Anyone in the world, we can we can get anyone. Yeah, anyone. Name it. Doesn't matter. Name them. We'll, we'll get them. them here. Maybe start with the gay women of the channel. Yeah, yeah. And then branch out. Always. Happy Wednesday, everybody, and we will be here same gay time, same gay channel, <laughs> same gay place, same gay place. Same gaze.